Let's define, we've talked about it briefly in past episodes, but I, I want to touch on this briefly just to define this term that people may be here, regenerative farming. Mm -hmm. They know it's good. They right. maybe know a little bit about it, but what sets regenerative farming apart and how is it different than just organic? Yeah, so regenerative, uh, it, it is so multifaceted. Um, and, and there's multiple ways to skin that cat. Um, it is, it is looking at soil health, community ecosystems, um, animal health, plant health, um, weather, you're, 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 you know, all these factors, weather, um, it, it all plays into this and you are, you are sitting there juggling each one of these, trying to make this balance um, wonderful ecosystem, and it's it's a way uh, that you aren't you aren't forcing nature to bend to your knees to, to its knees. It's it's a way to work with w amongst nature um, to where you can create production um, to grow incredibly healthy food um, that is healthy for the plants, healthy for the soil, healthy when we consume it, and overall healthy for the ecosystem and, and the wildlife around you. Because, you know, it's, it, it's, it, we're all living amongst that. And um, uh, it, is, it is a difficult thing to, to define because industry is constantly, they see, they see that money getting pushed towards it. I mean, people are, are striving for health in their bodies, health in their food. Um, and so big ag is trying to take those customers um, and and deceiving them, um, and and so it is. It's constantly a battle um, as a small farmer, you know, doing what is right, um, having the integrity and standards that we do um, to constantly try to redefine uh, what what we're doing because the industry takes takes that and and gets it uh, twisted where they can label their product with the words that we're using.